all about queen of positive vibes right here it's all about good vibes it's all about good vibes it's all about positive energy on here guys oh my days i am super super duper excited yes guys to celebrate this 700k followers i will be doing a giveaway yes you had that right i'll be doing a giveaway yes and the best part is mm, alexis and i are planning something huge okay and also guys i will be making a big announcement by noon tomorrow now listen up listen up turn on your notification bell so you can get notified when we are ready for you guys okay i love you guys and please oh did i forget to say my new followers thank you so much for joining okay i love you like i said it's all about positive vibes right here i love you guys and make sure you do not miss out on this one Mwah. i love you guys and bye i love you <laughs> Woo! 700 <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry man sorry Sorry, I... I didn't mean to. Sorry. It's okay. Um, I, I, I mean, you actually saved me, so it's fine. You see this fame, I must get that more. Joy, no more insufficient from the yeah, yeah, yeah. We must get the publicity. I must get that. I celebrity life is too sweet. But we go rock and No matter what you need, you take you. See, my friend, I don't tire for local life. I won't settle for less. So you go see me for press. You. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No more insufficient for love. You see this fame. I must get a more. I must get a Joy, more. Joy, no more insufficient from the world. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We must get the publicity. I must get a more. She be in the eye. She know they settle for less. She know they settle for less. And that is why you see her for press. He be back on. They be learn their so wife for us. I am insufficient for me. You see this fame, I must get a more. I must get a joy. No more insufficient for me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We must get the publicity. I must get a more. Celebrity life is too sweet. But we go rock and No matter what you need, you take you. See my friend, I don't tire for local life. I won't settle for less. So you go see me for press you. Yo, yo, yo. No more insufficient for love. You see this fame, I must get a more. I must get a joy. No more insufficient for love. Yo, yo, yo. We must get the publicity. I must get a more. So I am more insufficient for me. You see this fame, I must get a more. I must get a joy. No more insufficient for me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We must get the publicity. I must get a more. I celebrity life is too sweet. But we go rock and no matter what you need, you take you. Ma, I... Nandi, what is it? Okay, I was wondering if you have some clothes you would want me to wash. Nandi, you want to wash my clothes? Ma, is there anything wrong with that? 
Oh! <laughs> you know, sometimes I forget that, that I'm a celebrity, you know. These things. <laughs> you know, I want to tell you a story. Because I feel like I can actually confide in you. Yeah, sure, of course you can confide in me. It's back on Sufficient for me. You see this fame, I must to get a more. I must to get a joy. No more insufficient for me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We must get the publicity. I must to get a more. Celebrity life is too sweet. But we go work out. No matter what you need, you take you. You see, I was just that village girl. Lived in a shabby home with my poor mother. I did the cleaning, the cooking, all the chores. Livelihood was really difficult due to insufficient fund. I never had anyone do anything for me. I practically did everything myself, including the laundry. And then Alex's press cut came into my life and changed it, you know? And he told me to hire someone to do everything for me, all the chores, have a gate man and all that. And that's why you are here. As much as it's your job to do the chores, I wouldn't want you to do my laundry. I can do them myself. But my, I thought those are part of why I'm being paid. I mean, the chores and mm. wash your clothes. Namdi, you still be paid your agreed salary even if you don't do the laundry. My, I, I really do not mind doing the laundry. Come on, Namdi. I feel incapacitated not doing the laundry myself. I mean, come on. I'm okay, I would do it myself, all right? Okay, ma. Ma, I, I wanted to say Can something. Can you please drop this ma business? My name is Ebube. Or you can call me Bube or E.B. Hey, ma, I can't possibly call you by your name. P please. Oh, hey, Bube. Sorry. It's fine. Okay. I wanted to say, can I say something to you? Yeah, shoot. You are nice. Hmm. I wish people out there can see this part of you other than what you showed them on the social media. Nandi, let me tell you something, okay? People will always see what they want to see, no matter what you show them. They will always talk. So let them keep talking. Uh, well, I, I quite agree with you on that part. You're right. You're right. I'm always right. Bube is always right. Okay, so can I... Get you something to drink. Wondering if you care for any drink. <laughs> Nandi. Mm, I'm good. I mean, the girl is good. There is no longer insufficient fun. So, I'm living the baby girl lifestyle. So, I'm good. Hmm? Permission to... Run along, boy. No matter what you need, you take you. See my friend, I don't tire for local life. I won't say 
to for less. So you go see me for press. Yo, 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 yo. Namde. <laughs> wow, Namde. Uh, do I need to remind you that uh, the job of a housekeeper includes washing, cooking, cleaning, and ensuring that everything in the house is in order? But an affection towards your boss is not part of it. It's null and void. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> well, you see, in this place, I think I am your father. And I want to remind you that in today's world, it is not every Joseph who can survive the temptation of Potiphar's wife. So, Biko, Morokwanya, Kazu, Makodearao, Yarao. Thank you. I have heard your advice. I appreciate it. Mama, how are you? What are you doing here? Mama, why are you asking that? I mean, I came to see my mother. Am I not allowed here? Which mother? The one you don't have regard for. Mama, are we still on this? Come on. Well, look at me. My life has changed for the better. And I came back to, you know, transform my own mother. Why can't you just support me in all I do? Don't forbid I support such an evil act. <sighs> Evil act? Mama, what is evil about what I do? Do I kill? Do I steal? What do I do that is evil? Yet you end your living through dubious means. You are lying to people pretending to be who you are not. What different? What makes you different from a thief? Until you bring back my daughter. My Ebube Chuku, the one I raised. The God-fearing and honest girl that I raised that I breastfed. You are not welcome here. Mama, I got you some food stuff, okay? It's in the trunk of my car. Let me go get it. Try it, okay? Try it and I will burn you and burn that food stuff. I don't need them. I don't need such money. At least I can still put food on my table through honest means. You Honestly, baby, if you, you need to see the way my mother was just shouting, mm -hmm. saying that um, I should leave her house. This is not the way she trained me. What is wrong with me taking my mom out of abject poverty? Nothing. Nothing, babe. Do you know the food stuff I have in the trunk? Mm. She, she rejected them. She said she doesn't want to take anything from me. That my money is not a clean money. Can you imagine? Did you tell her you spill blood? I don't know. <laughs> hey, I'm just now. trying to make a name for myself. How is that a bad thing? Eh? It's fake it till you make it. So, babe, me, I cannot, I cannot deal with any man with insufficient fund. It's not possible. There are so many women today mm -hmm. living in abject poverty with a man because simply they want to get married. I'm not going to do that. My aim, my focus in this life is to be with a man that has money. And I want to be a social media influencer. Anything aside that is zero. Mm -hmm. So I don't understand what my mother is all about. I don't understand it. Eh? That I want to take my mother out of poverty. I don't know if she likes poverty. My mother likes poverty, I know. She likes poverty. But no, it's not for me. It's not for me. I don't know what else to do. Babe, I bet more would they go, I bet. I already told mama. I already told her to take it easy. I don't know. I mean, just... Ah. 
are coming for you business deal she and your stand. instagram this thing is just growing increasing by the day uh -huh. just take it easy pico i mean imagine i just wanted to change her life mm. want to change her life she doesn't want her life to be changed then let her be there now <laughs> i don't want anybody to stress me i beg oh I beg. my god that means we have enough food stuff <laughs> Are you mad or something? No, 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 no. If you want to die, why don't you just go and jump into the river or, or, or go to the, to, 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 to the express and kill yourself? What's the meaning of this? Do you want me to run you over? Is that for me? No, it's for your ghost. Of course, you know you're not going to do that. So, if I had not come here to look out, out for you, you would have come to the village and left without seeing me. Hey, but what is wrong with you? What is yeah, the guts for me. Say you as what? Who are you? Only cable. Listen to me, why not stop all this your drama, all this your charade, all this your lies and deceit and let us face reality. You belong to me, I am your husband to me. Your husband, your husband. Look at your mouth. Will you clean that mouth? You don't wield such power over me. What I do, I do it because I want to do it, not because of you. Whatever you do because you want to do it, you should not forget that you belong to me. You know, you must really be low. To think that what I do, I do it because of you. And so let me tell you something, I have nothing to prove. Okay? You know, I am so happy that I left this village. Because if I had stayed here, my dreams and aspiration would have been zero percent. Yes! So, you owe me nothing, I owe you nothing. Now you tell me what dreams do you have if not because I was the one who took you to the university, paid your school fees and then you now had dreams? Were you dreaming before you got to the university? If no, not of course! I applaud you. you. You you paid for my school fees. You took care of me in school. You paid for my schooling. That's fine. I appreciate you. But what did you do in return? You went to get another woman pregnant. And you come and you show your face to me? But I have apologized. I have apologized to you countless times. Are you not going to punish me all my life for just that small mistake? It was a small mistake. Of course it is a small mistake. A small mistake. A child is involved for crying out loud. You, you crossed the line, you, you went to impregnate another woman and you expect me to clap for you? No, I should clap for you, right? Nze, you're not serious. Ebube, you better end this nonsense and come back to me. Take that as a piece of advice. Don't underestimate me. You cannot threaten me. Nze, you cannot threaten me into loving you. Yes, I loved you. Yes, I was there for you. But you see that love, it is dead and I will never ever love you, even if you're the last man on earth. Nze! Nze, leave me. Nze! Hurtful, right? Oh, I want you to feel a fraction of the kind of pains you give to me whenever you stand before me to talk nonsense. Nze, leave me. Leave me this moment! You know what? Stand there. I will crush your leg now. I promise you something. If I don't have you, Nobody will. You are dreaming! You dare me! You are dreaming! You dare me! Ewu! 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 Ewu Nama! It's back up. They've been learning their so wife for us. I am insufficient for love. You see this fame? I must get a more. I must get a more. I am insufficient for love. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We must get a publicity. I must get a more. It's not a bad idea, but it's not a good one either. Now you are beginning to confuse me and I do not understand what you're saying. How do you mean? What impression did you create and what impact does it have on her? Huh? None. Now listen to me. She is not an enemy. So, you don't have to strike. You see, listen, you have to be fully strategized before you strike. Okay? You have to gather momentum to strike once, not to strike and miss and want to strike again.
Listen, I want to do anything and everything that it takes to get my woman back. Go ahead and tell me what I'm going to do. Very simple. It's very, very simple. Now listen to me. We have to use her own strategy against her. Okay? We have to make it smoke more intense so people will think that there is fire on the mountain. She will panic and leave the social media, then come back to you. You see? Or don't you want to have your woman back? Of course I do. Good. I am ready to do anything and everything that it takes to get a way back to me. Good. But all these things you are saying are yet to make sense to me. How do I do it? And I'm going to do that already without delay. Come with me. Come on. followers with TV endorsement deals. Girl, hey, are you all? You never see anything, babe. You're just talking. <laughs> you said 900, right? In a day or two, we are hitting a million followers, girl. See, I know come this town, come they can't bridge. How many bridge? Ah, oh, babe, I came for the real deal. I told you. <laughs> Have some li just a little faith in me. I get it. And then they actually believe that you are engaged to Alexis Prescott. Omo, babe, you know they understand. Whether they believe it or not isn't what is giving me the followers. What is actually giving me the followers is the is what I what I do to stir up the internet. Like you know, say controversy they sell. Yes, now that's why. When they look, why is this girl doing this? All of them will just flock to my page. Bam. Followers here and there. Mm. Babes, controversy or not, I did yeah. mm. They will flock. I wanted to talk to you about that posting stuff. I mean, you going as far as printing a wedding card with date and venue in it, don't you think it's a little bit too extreme? Well, social media thrives on extreme. Hmm. And the venue set in Dubai? An appropriate venue to suit the attention. Darling, if you haven't learned anything from me, learn this. See, let me tell you something. As you can see, it's paying off. Yesterday, I was 750K followers. In less than how many hours? Just I just posted that thing. I don't enter 900K. Tomorrow or day after tomorrow, I will stir up another one. I will hit 1 million followers. I think you need to clap for me. Anything what they talk, just clap for me. I mean, how oh. do you even come up with this whole idea? How? How? We work smart, girl. You know I'm brilliant. Come on now. See, not because I did with you for village. Girl, I came up with a first class. Now, because now, now, now condition make crawfish bend. <laughs> now, say my uncle no one make could stay in house. I, you know now, first class. So, I'm oh. very intelligent, girl. Okay. okay, okay, okay. And what happens? when the date comes and there is no wedding you know every blogger would want to carry this the news will circulate definitely what will you do about that then i come up with more stories to stir up everything i mean controversy girl oh my god you're unbelievable yeah baby ah, yeah baby see let me tell you something right fake it or you make it it's all about the moolah girl insufficient funds is not for me Okay. I really don't have much to say. You really don't have anything to say. <laughs> well, not just drink. We aim higher. <laughs> I do not settle for less, girl. That's why you get silver for press, girl. <laughs> <laughs> you know now. They've been learning their so white for us. I don't know insufficient for me. You see this fame, I'm not. 
us together more. Joy, no more insufficient from God. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We must get the publicity. I celebrity life is too sweet. But we go rock up. No matter what you need, you take you. See my friend, I don't tire for local life. I won't settle for less. So you go see me for press you. Yo, yo, yo. No more insufficient for love. Ah, what a way, Boos. What a I'm loyal. What a way, you're welcome. Yeah, Mr. Agumba. <laughs> but I mean, How are you? I'm Pasano <laughs> You're always funny. <laughs> That's my business. <laughs> um, Mr. Agumba, this is Ogubwa. She's my bosom friend. Okay? So I want you to treat her as part of this family, not as a guest. Okay? Okay, ma. All right. Okay, ma. Um, I have some things in the truck, so pick them up. All right? Okay, Madam Ogubwa, you're welcome. Thank you. <sighs> yeah, Madam Ogubwa, you're welcome. You're welcome. Sufficient for you. You see this fame? <gasps> my goodness. Welcome to my abode. Oh my goodness. Yes, girl. Give me. Yeah. This place is really nice. I know. Please sit down. Ah, sit down, me. Come down. Oh, wow. Yes. Ah, man. Anastasia must be very loaded to myself for keeping you this place. Yeah. What? <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, she's 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 okay. The place is nice. Very clean, very oh. <laughs> Welcome, Mas. Namdi, how are you? Good. Please go get the things I bought in the car. Hmm? Oh, okay. Alright. What? Babe! Who is he? Oh, that's Namdi, the help. I forgot to introduce you to her. Babe, this guy is so cute! Huh? Is he? Don't tell me you don't see it. I don't see it. Like I said, he's my houseboy. I'm sure he's I don't see you didn't see it. How can you be staying with a cute guy like this in the house? Come on, put it in for your old door. Babe, are you okay? No, how you do even take the look at me? I said he's my help in the house. No, no, babe. I don't understand you. This is Ebube, Ebube Priska Amosiki. E.B. Sparkles. Girl, babe, check and balance me well. Very well. Okay. And babe, check me out. Okay. Oh. Check me out, babe. Mm. Eh? No, I need. Check me out again. Girl, I mean, what are you saying, girl? Eh? Babe, I am higher. I never settle for less. That's why you didn't see me for press. You know what I want now. You know, you know the story. I know. Mm -hmm. Fame and money. And that's on a period, girl. Mm -hmm. But somehow, you got yourself involved with Nze. How? I was young and naive. Okay. Besides, Nze wasn't particularly poor. You know, someone who saw me through school, you can't call him poor. You can't call him poor. You know. Mm. So, what about love? Be love. What is love? Love don't buff. Love died with Nze. Please, babe, please just stop up this love talk. Um, oh, hey, baby. You know, it's not about you being in love. The question is, are you going to let yourself fall in love? I know you lost trust in men. And somehow you see Nze in all of them. You're my best friend. I respect your decisions. But somehow, I'm beginning to think Mama is right. 
Hey, Pepe, you can't continue living like this for the rest of your life. You will end up chasing potential suitors away. Don't you get it? I didn't invite you here to lecture me. This is my life. Making money and fame is my goal here. Eyes on the prize. Please, mind your business. Ogugwa, please. Okay. No problem. But I just hope by the time you realize all those things, it's not going to be too late for you. Thank you. Thank you. Stephanie? Thank you very much. I am fine. Now you're sounding like my mother. Oh, girl, you know we all mean well for you. I know you mean well. I know. It's just that sometimes I'm scared. Scared? Yeah, I feel like someone is following me or something. Someone is following. It would be, I think it's high time you stopped this. Please. It is nothing, okay? I am fine. Thank you. I am fine. Girl, thank you. I'm insufficient for me. Wow, you are such a good cook. I wonder who taught you the rudimentary recipe of cooking. He's such a magician in the kitchen. I'm telling you. Mm -hmm. I'm glad you like it, man. I love it. I love it so much. It was very delicious. Trust me. You know what? You will teach me that your magic. Don't even say no. Oh, okay. I will. Yes. <laughs> um, let me help you with the dishes in the kitchen. Okay? Oh no, don't worry. I handle it. Oh no, 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 I insist. Ah, don't worry. Oh no, nah, I insist. I insist. Hi. Hi. Ma. <laughs> oh no 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 no! Don't call me Ma again, okay? My name is Ogogo. Ogogo Mobi. <laughs> yeah. You know, I, I really don't feel comfortable when you call me Ma. Okay. So, what's your name? My name is Namdi. Oh, Namdi. What a fine name for a cute and strong man like you. <laughs> um, <laughs> you know we have a lot in common. Like um, your complexion. Uh, you, you know, you're cute and I'm, and I'm pretty. Um, Namdi, have you heard about um, the story of Esau and Jacob in the Bible? You know, Esau was very hairy, just like you. <laughs> he was a very strong man with, with a broad shoulder. His biceps were... Uh, and while Jacob wasn't hairy, <laughs> Uh, you, you can see, I'm not hairy. <laughs> that, that's the similarities we have. <laughs> I don't see you in I'm not in way. I'm not in a Namdi. After cleaning here, is there any other place you're going to clean? Um, I'm 
Don't try this again. Constant heat, bent and iron. Good morning. Is this you? It's me, ma. <laughs> morning, my dear. How are you? I'm fine. How is everything? I'm fine, good. Uh, <laughs> ma, welcome. I said, uh, let me bring this for you. <laughs> All this for me? <laughs> it's, it's nothing. It's just plantain. Hey, hey. Uh, I'm a you okay, babe. <laughs> <laughs> As usual. Hey, whoa. Thank you very much. Oh, no. All right. Thank you. God bless you. Bro. Bless you. Hey. I'm going to try and with So how are you doing? I'm okay. And you? I'm fine. <laughs> I'm fine. Um, Mama, you see, there is something important I want to discuss with you. That is also the reason I had to bring this, so that it will, you know, help to send the message very well. Uh, you uh, want me to help you prepare it or what? No, there is something important. <laughs> okay, yeah. let me put this in. Ah. Uh, let me give you this thing. Okay, okay. Agumba! Agumba! Agumba, how are you? I'm uh, fine. Are you? I'm okay. Yes. Um. But I wanted to ask you something. Um, what kind of a person is a Namde? Oh, oh, oh Namde. Yes. Oh, Namde is um, he's a kind of boy who will get a job as a houseboy, and he'll do it very diligently. You know, he's not distracted by women of uh, easy virtue. You know, he's not distracted by a woman's nakedness. He's not interested in where you were from. Oh, please shut up! Not, not even me. She... Shut up! I already know engaging in a friendly conversation like this will be time wasting. Friendly at your age, engaging you in a friendly discussion uh, will be of no financial benefit. Look at you. Hmm? What do you know about financial benefits? Now tell me, what do you know about financial value that you're still in this house doing it man job? Uh, financial, you, who even taught you that English? You ask you simple question, you, you're blabbing, talking rubbish. And then you're not going to carry on. I must to get that more. Joy, the more is sufficient for me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We must get the publicity. Um, yeah, I think it's high time we'll know what to do about this big girl. About things get out of hand. Yeah. Okay. Oh. Good day, boys. How are you? I'm fine, sir. Um, <clears throat> boys, I actually have thought through this whole day, and uh, I wondered why the sudden change of mind. 
I mean, why the sudden interest in trying to find a way to silence the Ibis Sparkle blogger of a girl? There's time for everything. Always time for everything. And I believe that time is now. Our rivals are beginning to buy her over advert placement. And she can use it against us. If we testify that all about her are lies, it will hit our rivals hard in their business and still strategy are misleading. And that's why we are losing the top with our products and services. This is the point we've been driving at all along. Um, as a matter of fact, don't you think it's too late now? Let me tell you something about branding. You cannot be with this company and you're using another product. Mm -hmm. You cannot be working with Nigerian brewers and you're drinking another beer. You cannot be working in an automobile company and you're driving another car. That's an aberration of business, branding and reputation. Now, I think um, I understand all what you're saying. So you mean you intentionally allowed her all along to play into your hands? You know what? I strategize to strike when there's something to strike about. She claimed to be in a relationship with the CEO of the press card. Meanwhile, she's an ambassador for another company. Hmm? She roped herself in when she designed a flyer with her company name carrying her face on it. And she did not go back to the social media to make a claim that our business with her is done. What I'm going to do is that I'm going to put a call to the barrister, Nizianya. They will pick her up and we'll start from there. What a master stroke. A smart move. A well calculated stride. Because I must confess, <laughs> I respect your wealth of knowledge and wisdom. Please, can we make that call now to move for the arrest immediately? Don't do that. I'm going to handle it myself. Back on, Obi. I am here. What? Shoot. Oh, man. What is it you want to discuss? <laughs> Mama, I do not know what else to do. I do not know what else to say to make a to, baby to accept me back. I have tried everything possible that I, I, I feel I should do to make her accept me back, but she is not bulging. I want you to help me, Mama. Help me. Help you. Mze. You should have thought about that before you impregnated that girl. Have you forgotten that you were a Bube's first love? The first male figure she worshipped. But you shattered her trust. Mama, it was a mistake. Yes, it was a mistake. A mistake born out of just one moment of drunkenness and then that was how Adeze got into the picture and I, I impregnated her. I have said it before and I'm saying it again, Mama. I am sorry. I am so sorry. The other time, my family and Adeze's family insisted that I was going to marry Adeze, but I refused because I do not love Adeze at all. The only thing that we have in common is that child that was born out of that nonsense and unreasonable mistake. Listen, Mama. I know I must have offended a baby. But my offenses are not so unforgivable that they should not turn her ways and think about me again. 
we have come a long way to just forget about relationship just like that. Mm -hmm. You need to talk to her. Mm -hmm. She needs to forgive me. Once a father, always a father. A sugar daddy. Not to married. be honest, you don't need to marry before you become a sugar daddy. So to be honest with you, I have spoken to a Biba about this issue on several occasions. But she wouldn't listen. I'm telling you, I have tried to make her see how genuinely sorry that you are. But she's not getting it. It's like the, 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 the wound in her heart caused by your betrayal caught deeper than we could imagine. Hey. Ebube, I know will not settle for anything until she destroys herself the way I am saying. Mama, please. I want you to still help me talk to her. Convince her. You are her mother. All those years that we shared together cannot just be forgotten. Just like that. Eh? I'm not getting any younger. My mates are getting married. I am tired of being a best man to my friends. Um, Mza Konobi. Mza Konobi. Ma? My advice to you is that you have to move on. You should move on. Look for another girl to marry. In fact, marry the one you impregnated. Because it will be no more listens to me. And the way I am saying it, it is not going to work. I don't want to mimic words. Mama? All I am just doing is to pray for my daughter. Prayers. Mama? I played a reasonable role in Ibube's life. I am part of the reason she got to the point that she is in now. Let me tell you, if Ebube does not come back to me as her man, who was there for her through take and thing when she was nobody, I'll be forced to do something that both of us will regret. Ebube <laughs> Ichuku is still my daughter. The fire I see in your eyes. Do not do something you will ever regret. Don't. Just pray. That's all. That's why you pray. I believe I'm my spirit. Do I bring your content? feel like going out again. Like, I'm so tired. You're not serious. Namdi, take this. You already know the pin to the card, okay? I want you to go to the market and buy those ingredients before I get back. Okay? Alright, thank you. Let's go. Let's go now. I'll wait for you. Uh, there's no way here. Okay, Namdi. Alright. You're coming back. All right, now I'll see you soon, okay? Mm. <laughs> I'll be back soon. <laughs> Hello, hello, Ebbe. Nze. Ebbe, how are you? So you still recognize my voice? What does that explain to you if not that our heart still connects? Hold on, hold on. Don't cut the call yet. What do you have to say, Nze? 
Listen to me, Yobuwe. You and I have been in this relationship for a very long time for you to think that you will just cheat me and then leave the relationship. Is this the rubbish she called me to tell me? I can see you have nothing, not, nothing important to tell me. Ewe, listen to me. Don't call the call, don't call the call. Listen to me. You and I have been in this relationship for a long while now for you to think that you will just jilt me and then go into another relationship. Don't try it because if you do, I am going to do something that you are going to regret. Trust me when I say that. Wait, is this a threat or, or, or something? Listen, Ewe, you know me too well. I don't threaten people. I don't threaten people. I make you a promise, Ebe. You are not going to leave this relationship for any reason at all. I have invested a lot in this relationship to make you think that you are going to leave me just like that. Oh, no, it's not possible. I will regret it. So now you are threatening me, Nze. No, okay, okay, what do you want to do? So what's the worst you can do? Go on social media and tell them that I am a liar? I'm a pretender that I'm posing to be who I'm not. Is that is that the that's the worst you can do, oh. right? Everybody knows that you're a liar. I know you to be too smart that if I make such statements against you in social media, you're going to find a means to double cross me and say things that will exonerate you. But let me tell you something that you don't know. I spent a lot of money, even in your education. So don't spend a second to think that you will leave this relationship. I will make sure you pay for this nonsense. Better come back to me because you belong to me. If I don't have you, nobody will. That was my promise and I'm going to fulfill it. Can you imagine this idiot? What does he mean? I don't understand it. Like, when you tell someone you're no longer interested in a relationship, is it not by force? No, not by force. I decided to be on my own. This guy is looking for my trouble. He's actually threatening me. Eh? He's threatening me. It's okay. Just calm down. Come on, let's go. I'm not going anywhere, babe. Uh -huh. What about the appointment? I insufficient for You see this fame, I must to get that more. I must We must get it. Hello. Oh, my love, what is happening? Huh? What is happening? I've been calling you on WhatsApp call, yet you're not picking my calls. What is happening? Come on. I know you've been busy over there, but I miss you so much. It's been two weeks now, and yet you haven't told me when you're going to return. You haven't stayed this long on business trip before. Baby, please, you have to come back. You have to come back, please. This is really frustrating. There's this stupid girl on social media claiming to be your fiancé. Yes, it's, it's really frustrating. You, you have to come back. What? No, 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 no. You have to come back and clear the air, please. Please, you, you have to come back. What? You mean you have to come back before you clear the air? Please. Baby, please, please, I'm begging you. This is really frustrating. Are you serious? Oh. <laughs> This is the best news I've heard in a long time. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I love you so much. And I miss you. <laughs> I can't wait for you to come back, okay? My kisses. <laughs> All right, baby. Bye. <laughs> Yeah, 
you know they settle for less. And that is why you see her for less. Sufficient for me. Okay, guys, it's okay, it's fine. Always follow EB Sparkles. What did I say? Bye. Follow EB Sparkles. Camera is not on. <laughs> of course, I'm not about to take selfie with a low life like you. <laughs> Smile. Um, <laughs> who are you? Oh, darling, my name is Amanda Uche, the original fiancé to Mr. Prescott. <laughs> <laughs> 